Hello again, everybody. I'm Storm Team 4 meteorologist Scott Steele in the Weather Center. Let's get right to the most important thing of all, right? Mother's Day is coming up. And what's the forecast? Well, it looks like you may earn some extra points if you hold the umbrella for mom if you're heading to brunch tomorrow morning because I think we'll see some showers overspreading southeastern Wisconsin again, mainly in the morning, and it's going to be a little brisk out there as well. 54 degrees, the highest I think will go through the day, chillier in the morning, and those northeasterly winds 10 to 15 miles an hour. Happy Mother's Day from today's TMJ4 and all of us in the Weather Center and in your weather headlines. As we go through the next couple of days, get ready for more gray days, some storms. I don't think we'll see as much stormy weather for the start of Mother's Day, but Sunday night into Monday morning, a possibility of some rumbles of thunder and still a chill to the air as well. Going into the record books on this date, 63 and 46, the high temperature officially at Milwaukee's Mitchell International, 63 and 44, the normals. So you say, oh, Scott, wow, we were right exactly where we should be. Problem is, our 63 degrees that we had on this date, Goes all the way back to midnight. Temperatures throughout much of the day barely cracking 50 degrees along the lake. It was much warmer inland. 93 the record high set back in 1934 and 26 the record low. High temperatures across the area. Our neighborhoods again through the day much warmer and some sun breaking through the clouds. Watertown 67, 66. Nitschke's in Beaver Dam and also 65 degrees for you fine folks who join us in Whitewater. Big storm system on down to our southwest producing huge amounts of snow in South Dakota dragging in very cold cold air around here. A warm front lifts to our north and that should help to warm us up as we head toward a Tuesday. But in the meantime, here's a look ahead at future forecast close into southeastern Wisconsin. You can see the scattered showers that arrive in time for the start of Mother's Day. I think they exit by the afternoon and then we just have a lot of clouds sticking around before we get the next round of showers and storms rolling through Sunday night and into Monday morning. If you're traveling around the Badger State for tomorrow, keep the umbrella handy. If you're visiting mom just about anywhere, again, those showers will be scattered about the area. Best chance of those in the morning hours around here. Your storm team forecast in specifics down to 44 degrees, which is warm for this time of year. Breezy and otherwise mostly cloudy. Then for Mother's Day, again, those morning showers, perhaps a crack of thunder. It's going to be chilly, 54 degrees and kind of breezy as well with clouds in the afternoon. Your storm team for seven day forecast calling for some drying conditions on Tuesday will cool down after near 70 degrees on Monday, right back down into the 50s and maybe some frost as we approach Wednesday and Thursday mornings, but at least we'll see some sunshine by midweek.